Hello YouTube, I'm Treacherous, and this is episode 12 of my Skyrim Mod Community playthrough. I'm just inside the cave of where we left off now, and I'm going to start the episode from here. Let's go guys. Alright Serana, let's be quiet. Whoa, what is that? Whatever it is, it's fucking awesome. Hmm. Let's see. Well, anyone in here is bound to be a bad guy, so... It actually looks like a Dawn Guard. Oh, I did get him in the head. One last shot. Damn it, he moved. Huh. He doesn't know what's come where it's coming from yet. Oh Damn it, I thought he, he stopped moving. Oh, uh, did Serana go down there by herself? No, she didn't. Now what's going on? Who's fighting who? Whatever. I'll let this chaos. Oh, didn't draw that far enough. Did he die? I think he did. Just hang on, Serana. We'll get to a little more. Oh. Those Dawn Guards. That must be another vampire. Who should I help? Actually, I'll be smart and let them fight each other. Where's that crossbow coming from? Ah. Gotcha. That vampire's strong, whatever he is. He's probably not friendly, though. Shit. Yeah, look at the arrow. Oh, damn. Oh, fuck. Get him, Serana. No, don't kill me. Serana, get him. Fuck, get him. Oh, thank God. Can I feed on him? Holy crap. That was fucking close. What the hell? A feral vampire nightwalker. Bastard was strong. Yeah, I am. Thanks. You saved my ass. Watch the fire. Any of those bodies over here I could feed on? Armored troll. Yes. That'll do. I forgot to do this. Is everyone dead? Looks that way.
What's wrong? I bet you that's the moss priest is in there. Oh, it's just quietly. Uh, that always feels interesting. Feed me. Shit. Oh, that hurt. Is that all of them? Oh. This form feels like a rush. And how do I feed in this worm? Oh, whoa. Blood just flows into my wounds and heals me. Ha <laughs> ha. That works. Can't complain about that. That must be the vampire who stole the moth priest. Let's get out of. Oops. I'm still not used to that. Stone focus. Hmm. Up there. Nope. Oh, it's a little hard to run in this form. Let's float then. Get up, Serana. You alright? You might want to move out of the fire there. I can't use this for a dial on him. Serana, move! Command the Moth Priest. By the divines, <laughs> my eyes have been opened. I am blinded by the light of your majesty. I, I must obey you. Damn straight. What would you have of me, master? I command you to travel to Castor Volkiar. Certainly. Where can I find this castle? Off to the north coast of Skyrim, due west of Solitude. I will set out at once, then. Well, well, let's get out of this form. Ugh, ugh. Oh, wow. ugh. That always feels weird. Uh, let's look around real quick before we leave. Ooh. What time is it? It's midnight. So I've plenty of time to get home. Ooh. not working in here. Okay. Yeah. I need more blood. Let's just go down from here. Ugh. Come on, Serana. 
We're heading back to the castle. Oh yeah, that was a troll. Asshole. He gave me more trouble than those Dawnguard did, but he kind of took him out for me. Can't complain, I suppose. Go, Serana. Oh, that's the wrong ability. Although that ability. Oh. There we go. <laughs> See you there. Dun 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 Yeah. Whoa! The fuck you come from? Oh my god, really? Serana, get him, he caught me off guard. My thralls here. Shit. Oh, I have the wrong spells up. Because he's not going unconscious, that's what it was. Fucking Dawn Guard. Second time they've interrupted me. I think he's dead, Serana. Or you're bugged. I'll ignore that and go to the castle. Let's fix it. Shit, more of them? Serana, I'll let you deal with that. Make sure my thrall guy here. I gotta love these little tiny bugs you find everywhere. Even though I've got all these patches to fix them. It's probably because of all the mods. <laughs> I mean, literally, I have at least a hundred and. I think. 186 mods now. 286 mods now. Serana? Where's Serana? She'll join me. I hope she will. Let's wait. Falkhorn. Well done. Somehow I knew it would be you who found our moth priest. <laughs> yep. Well, I made the moth priest my thrall. Yes, I see that. I trust his capture was not too difficult to task. Uh, the Dongard did try to stop me, but they really didn't pose too much of a threat. Command him to read it, and let
Let us hear the words of prophecy together. This will be interesting. There you are. Master, I have done as you asked and traveled here. Good. Now I have a task for you. Of course. What is it that you need me to do? You must read an Elder Scroll. Ah, yes, the Elder Scroll. I admit, I am looking forward to this. Then you may begin. Of course, Master. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. A I know bow? this weapon. It is Oriole's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the night's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light. Hmm. The night and the day will be as one. The voice hmm. fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. Elsewhere? I think there is more to the prophecy recorded in other scrolls. More scrolls, great. I see them now. One contains the ancient Shut up back there. Dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. Ancient blood. The vision darkens, and I see no more. What? The complete prophecy. We must have the other two scrolls. Hmm. Well... Even so, you did well. <laughs> well, do you know where these other scrolls are? My traitor wife stole one of them away and then disappeared. As for the other, the last that I heard, it was lost in the bowels of a Dwemer ruin. <laughs> it seems our work is not yet done. But I have waited this long and we are so very close now. I can wait a bit longer. Passengers of virtue. Well. If you need anything, say the word. I can still forge a decent blade. Uh. I am but your humble servant. <sighs> Shoot, I guess I should talk to Saran and I'll see what's up. I am above the petty squabble here. Serana. I have lived for far too long. Not a I do. So what's on your mind? That mark plays Vexen. You said we needed two other elders. Hmm, well that's convenient. So why didn't you say something earlier when your dad was here? Didn't want that lot getting wind of it. Especially my father. Really? Hmm. So do you trust your dad at all? It's not a question of trust. He's just obsessed with the prophecy. And from what I could tell, a thousand extra years of obsession haven't made him undead. Eh. I should have found him a hobby. <laughs> I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. Hmm. So, where's this Elder Scroll you know? We need to find my mother, Valeria. She'll definitely know where it is. She's still alive? She actually has it herself. Hmm. Yeah, but you said you didn't know where she was. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. Hmm. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe... Well, I don't know. Sounds like she was being cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Hmm. No... I wouldn't think she'd be sealed away where you were. That'd be too obvious. Wait, obvious? Hmm. <laughs> what about right here in the castle? That almost makes sense. I used to help my mother tend a garden in the courtyard here. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Ha! <laughs> so, isn't that pretty risky staying here, though? 
But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. Hmm. Well, how can we get there without your father even noticing? I mean, this is his castle. Well, let's go to the castle's entrance then. Come on, it's just around the side. And guys, I'm going to end the episode here, and we'll pick right back up here in the next episode, alright? So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.